also come to the rather dramatic conclusion that I don't need to have my room lights on if I have this light on, and the green screen still looks good. Which means I no longer feel like everything's bright and hot in the room, which is cool. Okay. Get the pump in a bit. What's going on, Kev? Game time. You already know what's up. Hold up. Alright. I was wondering if I could get back on the same platform. Uh, no point in going that way, we'll just get the pup. How has your day been, fellow gamer? Oh, I didn't even grab the pup. Patriot's Mid as a first item is so weird, totally like... My brain doesn't like it. And there we go. Ah. Oh. Decent first level. Good money. We actually got good items too. We're like relatively kitted out. I mean, obviously, it's like pretty ancillary, like non ancillary shit. Fucking pictures met in uh, uh, spring shoes, which is kind of stuff that a lot of times people go out of the way to avoid. But very helpful, regardless. Oh shit! I didn't think about that. That was kind of impossible, because I was always going to shoot him. Yeah, because I was hoping I could get through into the shop and then just ice ray him, which would have worked. But uh, he was always going to go aggro the instant that arrow hit him, and I wasn't going to stop that arrow from hitting him. Okay. Luckily, we should be able to kill him and get the shotgun pretty easily. We don't have sticks, but we got a lot of bombs, and we do have an ice ray. Which, if I feel like being ballsy, is a pretty powerful weapon. Okay. We're not gonna be ballsy. <laughs> Holy shit, I just happened to very luckily hit him. That was hilarious. I mean, like, it sucks that I took the damage first, but... Alright, we'll get the shotgun, set that at the exit. I really do need to get that pup just because I did take so much fucking damage. Moving on. And as I mentioned, we're gonna beat the, in the title, we're gonna beat that pirate owl game first. I mean, well, after. If there's still time, I don't know what I will do. Very inconvenient shop location. Please move further away. Because then if I can secure that bomb box, it would be very good. Cool. Uh, keys? Any keys? Oh no, we got six. Ah, keys. Alright, that's done. We're armed, we got... Good supply on bombs. Not even gonna bother with that arrow trap or that uh, queen spider. He's angry, that's fine. That's like his personal right to be angry with my life choices and decisions. And 
if I keep shooting this way, he should be done. Should already be dead, actually. But we'll give him one more just for, for good measures. Alright, let's see how much favor we can get now. Great item. Okay. I'm pretty confident now. We're not even done with 1-3 uh, and we've already got a pretty fucking bonkers uh, build. Mad items on deck. Now if we can get that Kapala though, we, we're really out here ensuring victory. But it takes at least one more uh, corpse. I don't think it's possible on this stage. Yeah, not possible. Still pretty good. Next one we find it's guaranteed though. We're just not gonna fuck with- mm. For the money and also there's two crates. That I couldn't have gotten without that. It ended up being worth. That pup's dead as fuck. Anything going on over here that I care about? Not particularly. I tried to run and crap collect the blood drops as if I had the Kapala. Cool. Moving on. On to the jungle. Still got what? 19 bombs, right? Oh, wait, no, we grabbed that bag as well. 21? 22? 22. Gotta make sure we don't miss the market, which I'm okay with spending a few bombs to try and locate. Make sure I'm not missing any locations. Most of the time I'd be afraid of just exploring too much in case I'm just like wasting the resources. What's going on, Darian? But a run like this, we can be a little more liberal with our resources. I'm still shook by the gigantic balls I had in trying to kill that shopkeeper with just the ice ray. Hmm, no you don't. Ah! It is right here. Oh. It is in fact down there. This sucks. I don't have faith in myself to be able to drop down from that tree branch, grab the uh, gun, and also like, or like, and then activate my cape in time to be able to grab the gun. What happened down here? Why? Why is the shopkeeper already gone? Is he dead or no? Okay. God, thank god they don't actually just shoot when they're stuck on those things non-stop, otherwise I would have died a while ago. That shit's terrifying. Yikes. Bitch. Alright, if any motherfuckers out here living on this top floor, 
Not anymore. Oh, and it's a Restless Dead level? It's too bad that uh, Restless Dead levels on the black market can't give you a castle level, because that'd be like primo progression right there. <gasps> Fucking die? Thank you. Merchant soup. It'd really be like that sometimes. Especially in the black market. Damn, he got fucked up. Idiot. This is why I was okay with being a bit more liberal with bombs too, because, uh... Your boy gets a lot of bombs on the black market. Damn, friendly fire. Come on, I know I can get you. Oh, fuck, he got stuck on that one little ledge, otherwise I would have gotten him. Oh, see that time I knew. That time I knew he was going to get stuck on the ledge, so I altered my timing. I actually would have gotten him the first time. I'm nice. Ooh, I'm nice. Yeah, that's a black market, bro. The only way to get the Ankh without, like, murdering every shopkeeper in the entire game uh, is to spend 50k gold on that level, which I go for score, so obviously I don't want to be spending money, like, so that's stupid, right? Simply foolish, one might say. Um, also, it's just less fun. It's way more high octane to just, you know, come for these motherfuckers where they live, you know? Ah, there was a giant frog here and he died. Alright, give me that Kapala. Oh, I didn't even grab it. Nice. Nice. Ha 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 ha! Sickos. That worked well. Boop. Bitch. Wow, this is a mess. I hate how enemies can body block every single shotgun pellet. Moving on, we don't have anything left to worry about in the jungle. Look pretty clean. Just gotta look out for the Moe statue and uh, hope the hope I continue to have good luck because this this runs uh been up pretty decent so far. B level, helpful, not the greatest. B levels are nice because sure they give you uh, four HP for free, right? Which is like really strong. But if you're going for a hell run, you're it doesn't matter because you're gonna sacrifice yourself before that I mean after that anyway. Um, but also the main advantage to them is getting you to the, the Moe statue, right? Which sometimes some crazy shit happens. And normally the the craziest amount of shit that will happen to you will be actually the uh, the black market. Which is why it's definitely preferred. To, uh... to 
to get it before the uh, black market, if you get it at all. Still helpful. And you already took like 5 HP? Bro, what do you mean? Oh, life up. You start at 4, bro. Oh, that too. But that's fine, because I was just grabbing the honey. How was your day, Alvaro? Yeah, you can stay and shit up there, bro. That's like your prerogative. I don't mean to tell nobody how to live their lives. Day was good? That's good. It's good to be good. Finally can rest after weeks of projects? Nice. You just got finals now? Yeah, yeah. Let's get it. Big moves, big money. Aw, oh, lame. I was hoping to go boink, bonk, right from one alien to the other. Six on every class. I believe in you, brother. On every exam, rather. Yeah, yeah. Come on. There we go. Oh, that I nearly fucked up big there. Alright, this is going to be a little BM, but I'm going for it anyway. <laughs> ah, so funny. I'm actually not going to bring the shotgun with me to the next level. For the simple fact that um, I'm about to kill myself and lose it anyway. So I don't really care if I lose it this level or the next. Oh shit! Wow, this is a great seed. Daily challenge... Yo, daily challenge today for anybody that plays Flunky is actually really fucking good. This is a great daily. And free fucking jetpack. I'm gonna turn that down a little bit. I'm actually gonna skip some. Nice. Bonk. That alien didn't even fire a single fucking thing at me. Yup! Yeah. <laughs> uh, shit's so funny. I wonder how much the seed ties to. Does it even tie to what items you get from what? From the... Sacrifices? Oh, I know it does actually, because I remember when Alvi did it, he got the same item. Yeah, that's right, when we did the, the fuck shit. That was great. Come for me. Wow, something happened here. Yeah, the fuck's your run. Yeah, you got the same item from the altar that I did. Which means that it's tied to seed. Fuck, it'll save the pup. Luckily, I could have grabbed the wall anyway. Alright, it doesn't even matter what happens. I kill myself this level anyway. Yeet! <laughs> this is my favorite level in the entire game, because I can just do all kinds of stupid shit. Or I develop the entirety of my stupid strategies. Yeah. Hold up. Hold up. Alien. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna try and see if I could get the alien above the mammoth and have him pew shoot his blast and kill it. It was always gonna work out. Yeah. Wasn't what I was going for. 
But as long as I die, it works, right? So... It's kind of hard to fuck up at dying, I've usually found. Actually, I have fucked up at dying plenty of times, I'll tell you. I've actually gone through the exit on that stage, where you, sp where you have to die. I've gone through the exit multiple times, and been like, fuck. I wasn't supposed to clear that stage. <laughs> you just autopilot, right? That's why I make it such a big deal of telling myself, alright, end yourself this stage. This is the part where you die. Oh, that was what I meant to do. But I made the golden monkey. I was just trying to set the idol down. If you sacrifice a golden idol, make a golden monkey that a monkey that poops gold. Which sounds really good, but it's kind of not. I think the golden monkey killed itself. Yeah, it fell into the pit and died. That's not new, actually. Boom. It poops gold, but the gold isn't that helpful because it actually makes you less money. It poops like those things, like the tiny little gold bits, which makes you less money than if you just brought the idol to the exit. Unless you could bring the poop monkey with you through the entire game. Which could be pretty impressive. Either way, uh, apparently there was a mine and it killed the shopkeeper and his gun happened to land there. So he didn't have to try hard to get a weapon. Everything's working up, out, bro. It's great. This is the only problem. We gotta not fuck up here. Uh, I don't have any ropes, so I can only cling to walls, basically. Pretty inconvenient, to be honest. It doesn't sound like it would be, but it is. Luckily that will destroy that. That gives me another safe place to be, which is over here. Alright, Anubis, come here. Bitch. Cool. Now, don't forget to grab the scepter. I've done that before, too. Fuck, you went for the wrong thing. So it goes for the nearest life, what, like carbon-based life form, living or not. So you just have to manipulate the area to remove the things you don't want it to target. It can also go for you if there's nothing else, so... <laughs> Careful. Can we get this pup? Yeah, easy pup. Nice. Whoop. Hi! We're gonna drop down through because we're not gonna bother seeing Sobek over there. Grab the ma these materials. Fuck. There we go. I don't take chances with uh, no push blocks no more. They are the devil. Ah. Do 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 do. I'd want to get that supply crate, but there's also motherfucker and push block. Fuck. 
It was only ropes. Not worth it. I'm an idiot. Uh, do I care to explore this area a little more? reason they do that it's because they trap you but if you remove the wall it doesn't trap you because obviously there's no wall to close anymore yay man i love indiana jones moving on city of gold time okay yeah as usual fuck a push block i'm out Let's go! Let's go! Let's fucking go! Health farm. The spit, the game thinks is blood, because they just recolored it. Maybe this way you won't die. Yeah. I'll probably get to at least around 20. I'll do this to open the door to the Book of the Dead now while I'm at it. I guess I gotta throw two. And then around two minutes in, I will uh, go. But let's try and get to 25, maybe even 30 health. I think that's about enough. Aha! It is you, Anubis 2! You thought Anubis 1 was strong enough. Have somebody that's infinitely weaker that doesn't have an insta-kill move and just summons a bunch of shitty fucking enemies that don't actually really do damage ever. And will never ever harm you or kill you. Ah! He is the sequel! Anubis Jr. He's the Anubis the second. That's why he's weaker. Okay, I get it now. I understand. He's not V2. He's he's the second. He's the child of Anubis. Okay. Now we got to figure out where the Book of the Dead is signaling. If you look at the HUD, it's a little book there that's dancing next to my money. Where it's dancing, I go there. I go to hell. Daily challenge is great today. You'd have to be a fucking amateur to fuck up this run. I say moments before fucking up the run. Somehow, some way. Alright. You're gonna come over here. You're gonna sit in the corner. Actually, you're gonna go the other way. You're gonna come over here, because it's on the left side. And I don't want you interfering. Can't quite see it from there, so I need to get a little lower. Luckily, no time limit here. Golem said, fuck ghosts. So my two tunnel points should be, like, here. Uh, 
and here. I hope this is, like, wide enough from the fit. Because I've had that issue before, but we'll just jump over it. Okay. It is ready for you, your highness. Your eternal slumber awaits. Oh, this is looking good. This is looking good. Woo! Yeah, pretty good. The unfortunate thing is now I am very low on bombs. And bombs are a very vital resource. Bye. I don't care about fighting him. I just I'm I'm trying to get that dub now. As far as I know, you also can't get any supply crates in hell. Which oh, just kidding. I'm an idiot. There's one literally right there. Oh, it's you can't get shops in hell. Yay! More bombs. I was only able to just, like, brute force my way through that because of how many hearts I had. That is the only reason I am alive. Oh, I didn't get Vlad's Ruby. That's fine. It was too dangerous. That just means I can take damage from fire. If you get that item, you can't take damage from fire, which is very helpful, but we have to go without. The exit shopkeeper got pissed off already, which bodes well. 29 HP, though? Yeah, yeah you're right. Well, the problem is, it makes you immune to lava, too, and lava is an insta-kill. That's where the real value comes in. It also means you don't get hit-stunned by fire, either. Moving on. Boss battle. I should have gone for the golden idol because that was a pretty simple level actually and I could have safely gone up and grabbed it. But also if I fucked up with all those spike balls I would have just been over, you know? And this is why I'm never too worried about running out of bombs at the final fight.
Alright, now we just mash X a bunch. As much as I love this game, one of the things I will acknowledge about the combat is that the combat gets really fucking lame if you play it, like, optimally. Like, it's really fucking lame. Because <gasps> you just fucking, like, spam a shotgun from a million miles away, you know? Where'd the gun even go? I don't know where my gun went. Oh, there it is. He's not dead, so where the fuck is he? I suppose it's part of the high risk high reward of the fact that I should stop doing that. That spot a, sto a stone always falls on me. Oh fuck! Yeah, you better be done. Thank you. Please clap. Alright, now we just get all the loot. <laughs> yeah, when a lot of uh, when a lot of the shopkeeper fights and like boss fights end up being you, know, you just like spam your shotgun at everything off screen. That part's kinda lame. But also the combat's so punishing. It's kinda hard to do anything else. Still don't keep a turn-based RPG. Bro! That's literally just called NetHack, idiot. Minecraft 2, no. That's just called Rogue at that point. Not right. This isn't gonna be a high score, but... Pretty good. Fuck you, if I landed on those spikes at that point, holy shit. Whatever. Y'all can live. Greetings, fellow treasure hunter. I'm Yang. I see you have my journal with you. My name must be filled with all sorts of amazing things. Since you worked so hard to get here, I bet you're expecting a large reward. Well, with all the time I've spent down here, I've come to realize a few things. That the journey is its own reward, and mastery is the greatest treasure of them all. Well, a case of gold is pretty nice, too. That was a pretty short death streak. Very good. Oh, I didn't play the video! No! Okay. okay. <laughs> Rank four. There are three people higher than four. Three of them. Only three. None of them even beat hell! Okay, this dude... This... This dude got... Uh... He only got to four or three. He didn't even get to Almec, or beat Almec. And he got... 1.2 mils? This dude was on the same level, got 1.0 mils. Damn. I feel- I feel bad compared to this guy, bro. He didn't even- He got a regular fucking ending, and he still did higher than me. Look at all these scores! There are tens of players! And I- I was number four! How many? There's probably like 60, I think. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I did really good!
Oh, fuck. Pog champ? Yeah, that is a thing people say. Wait. Yeah. Can I... I'll drink. But I just want to know how many people did it today. I just want to know how people did the daily so far, you know? Damn, there's still a lot of people. Because, like, technically this is tomorrow's, you know? Because that's when I do it. And there's already, like... Over a hundred. Ah, uh, then again, most of these people are on like one, 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 two. So we're getting to the bottom of the barrel here. All right, yeah, yeah. These people have zero. Literally, how do you die with zero dollars, bro? How does that even happen? I'm sorry. I don't mean to judge, but like, actually, how do you die before grabbing a coin? A single coin. How? How are there greater than? Okay, there was that many. One fifty-two. You died with zero dollars when? I don't see your name on the leaderboard, idiot. It's called the Amer- oh fuck. Yeah, true. That shit'll happen. Cool. I did good. I'm proud of my Spelunky accomplishments for today. I'm a top 5 NA Spelunky player, bro. I feel privileged to have the- like- be- to be allowed to view me with your eyes. You were able to witness my glory. Frankly? If I were you, I'd feel pretty happy with myself. I don't know about you, but I know about me.